Welcome, everyone. Hold on tight. The impossible has become reality. For one night only, we bring you a matchup for the ages. NBA legends from two different eras will go head-to-head. -head. The visiting 90s West All-Stars will face off against the 80s West. This is Kevin Harlan here with Clark Kellogg. Cheryl Miller is our sideline reporter. And now, as we're about set, T-Mobile presents the starting five lineups. And without further ado, it looks like they're setting up for the tip-off. The 90s West take the tip-off and will set up the offense. to Elijah Wan. Takes it up. Malone snatches the defensive rebound. And now our sideline reporter Cheryl Miller has some information for us. Let's check in with the Gatorade around the cooler update. Well, I had a moment to speak with Greg Thomas, coach of the 80s West All-Stars. He knows that his team has to fight for every rebound. Otherwise, they'll get eaten alive on the glass. All right, Cheryl. 119 left in the first. Worthy. Goes up. It's blocked. Tried to shoot it over the big man and got embarrassed. Here's Mullen. It's good. It's so good, he makes that play look routine. Elijah Wan inbounds the ball. Lobs it to Malone. Let's it go from the wing. Buries it. Malone knocked it down in the face of the deep. Kevin, I know the flashy dunks make the highlight reel, but these shots count just the same. To the strike. Passes it to Drexler. The tray offline by Mullen. It's not about to allow a good look. Nice job contesting that shot. Drexler has it right wing. The dish to Malone. Fades back. Elijah Wan is on it. Kid. Off right iron. Kid typically makes that one from mid range. The defense caught a break there. Drexler. Bullseye. Kid releases. We're at the end of one. The score 8 to 4. The 90s West have taken the early lead. Well, they've been getting out on the break and finding easy buckets. You gotta give them credit. They've been working their tails off. All right, the second quarter should begin momentarily. Elijah Wan inbounds it to start the second quarter. Here's Drexler. Graceful finish. Well, he's really special. The defense has to account for him at all times. Johnson. When the defender has the length advantage on you, you better have a plan B. Dishers to the middle. The layup cashed in by Drexler. Great vision on display there. The pass led him perfectly to the basket. That's how you do it. To Elijah Wan, takes it up. Great finish in traffic. Elijah Wan has the right idea. Squeeze in close and knock it down. 117 left in the second. Tipped, but it's recovered by the 80s West. Offensive rebound corralled by Sigma. Worthy shoots it. Gets the go-ahead fire. Worthy. That was a difficult shot there, but Worthy Luck smiled on him and he knocked it down. Here they go, Kevin. Man-to-man -man defense. Here's Johnson. He gets hammered and he'll head to the line. Really one of the outstanding little men in the history of the NBA. He's one of only a handful of guards to have scored over 20 points a game in the season and average double-digit assist in the same season. Truly a remarkable player. Both teams will make substitutions. You don't 
expect anything less when he's at the line. He's just a terrific free throw shooter. Sigma inbounds the ball. Magic draws the foul. He'll get a trip to the line. He knocks down the first one. He gets them both. Richmond behind the arc. Automatic. When the margin's this tight, every basket starts to take on a little bit more meaning. Blackman. Goes up. Hits the layup after the sweet pump fake to freeze the D. Elijah Watt inbounds the ball. Here, they'll want to hold for one shot. Blackman is tagged with the reach. That's his first foul of the game. And the bonus is go to the line. The refs are not going to let you just mug the ball handle like that. That's an easy call for the official. And he makes the first one. Gets them both. 16 seconds left in the half. Dishes to Johnson. English passes it to Sigma. Here's number 22. Drops in the buzzer beater. And that concludes the first half. The score, 18 to 17. Man, there's been a lot of offense so far. Both sides are having no problems finding the net. Quite a show so far, that's for sure. And now, the T-Mobile Halftime Report. James Worthy is our leading shot blocker with one. Let's have a look at the team stats from the first half. The 80s West All-Stars have been finding good looks, as you can see from their shooting percentage. Yeah, they really seem to be in a rhythm. But can they continue their hot shooting in the second half? 